I didn't talk to Morden. Where is he though? Was he? Shepherd, yeah, there he is. Blood work complete. Indicates significant stress on Eve's system. Malin's data thorough. Fortunately detailed as well. Have used notes to improve her condition. Ooh. Sweet. Have you determined why she's immune? Genophage targeted hormone production during pregnancy. Modification project used same modality. Her immunity totally different. Targeted glands now obsolete, like human appendix. Other glands mutated to produce proper hormones, enable viable birth. Also explains her weakness. Gland substitution, imperfect. Health trouble. You think you can make this work for all Krogan? Yes. We'll use Eve's tissue to produce mutagen, alter gland function across entire species. Must improve mutagen as well. Tune hormone production. Long-term illness for all Krogan otherwise. So, we did the right thing by saving the data? Indeed. Would be much harder to treat Eve without it. Maybe impossible. And all those experiments we saw back on Tachunka? Monstrous, repulsive, but now with purpose. Victims didn't die for nothing. So the end justifies the means? Not my means. But you're using the data. Encouraging more experiments like Malin's. Encouragement irrelevant. Will always be scientists willing to perform unethical tests. Can't change that. But can help Eve. Can cure Genophage. Won't ignore data vital to her survival because of unethical origins. Any word on Malin himself? No. Ordered teams to search for him when trying to help Eve. Nothing so far. Large galaxy. Lots of places to hide. Could already be dead for all we know. Would kill him now if possible. Unless he could help. <laughs> How is she doing? No fever currently. Heart rate elevated. Likely stress. Eating appropriately. Could use another blanket. Something soft. Prefer to let her recover fully before synthesizing cure. My medical recommendation. My people don't have time for that. Her opinion, somewhat different. You care about her. <laughs> my patient. My responsibility. Found her at STG base. Three doctors injured trying to restrain her. Undid arm restraints. Didn't resist when she grabbed me. Promised to help her. She said, please. You've always defended your genophage work. What changed your mind? Never changed mind. Genophage proper decision at time. New circumstances necessitate course correction. Those circumstances being? Reaper invasion. Turian's doomed without Krogan support. Krogan need unified threat, outlet for aggression, cooperative symbiosis. Nothing else? No personal stake here? Getting old, Shepard. Not many years left. But still best candidate for project. Few Solarian scientists interested in genophage. None with my expertise. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong? Possibly. Stakes too high for inexperience. But not about them. My work. My job to put it right, to prove I can. Nice talking with you, Morton. Thank you, Shepard. Glad to be back. You planning to stick around when this is over? Until Reaper's dealt with, at least. Then, not sure. Have made impact on Galaxy. Genophage modification, genophage cure. Work against collectors. Decisions, mistakes. Might go somewhere sunny. Sit on beach, look at ocean, collect seashells. You'd go crazy inside an hour. Might run tests on the seashells. <laughs> Uh, I love this game. I don't know why, but this one always seemed more involved. I always enjoyed it more. Commander, you to say? nice to yep. see you again. How are you settling in, trainer? I actually feel somewhat useful. It's been challenging to integrate data feeds for the War Summit. How are the systems holding? Well, I'm glad we performed stress tests. Specialist trainer has been extremely helpful. The accuracy of our war room data is a direct result of her work. Thank you, Edie. I'm still getting used to all of this. In the lab, we'd hoard everything, piles of tech everywhere. Out here, it's like living out of a shoebox. Life on an active ship always feels crowded at first. You'll get used to it. Oh, it's not a bad thing. I've got no problems getting cozy. <laughs> This is wonderful. Back in the lab, we had to hoard because we had no budget. Now, Edie, 
Ariaki Tech uses a proprietary smart processing algorithm that could clean up our long-range data. Can we license it? We can. Analyzing and applying the upgrade now. The algorithm should reduce long-range strategic combat data analysis time by 3%. Impressive. If it means getting the equipment I need, I can quite happily live out of a shoebox. <laughs> All right, we got the last two people to talk to, and then we explore the galaxy again, turn in whatever we have, whatever we collect, and head to the next three missions. They've got so much in common, like shooting things and not wanting to die. Now that's about it. Hey, I know I used to rag on Garrus for being all angry, but I'm glad he's back. There's a whole lot of crap out there, and it's a bullet between the eyes. Plus, we might need something calibrated. That's going to be a running joke in this game. I wouldn't be surprised it if we hear that a few more times. I have questions about the genophage. You and everyone else. What do you need, Edie? A Krogan female of breeding age can produce clutches of up to 1,000 fertilized eggs over the course of a year. There are over 1 billion females on Tichunka. If even 1% become fully fertile, they can birth 10 billion infants. On Earth, bugs have a lot of young, too. Most of them die. The attrition rate would naturally be high. But the state has an interest in keeping the children alive for warfare purposes. Any other cheerful thoughts? Logistics. <laughs> Even were they to side with us, transporting the Krogan to the battlefields of Palavin could prove difficult. They have been demilitarized. That is, they have no warships. What do you suggest? They will need Turian or civilian starships to carry them to battle. With your permission, I will make the necessary calls to have these ships in place for when you deliver the Krogan. Do it. Anything else? food. They will be unable to eat anything on Palavin. They must bring their own or rely on the nutrients in their humps. This keeps getting better and better. The Krogan will also require sedatives, since Krogan fight with others of their kind in enclosed spaces such as starships. Make it happen. Are there any last things you're worried about? Nothing that demands your attention, Shepard. Morton sent me a nicely crafted message. It seems he recalls our conversations about the Salarian equivalent of transhumans. If I could, I'd stop you right. Transhumans have some of their brain's abilities, such as memory, supplemented or entirely replaced by cybernetics. Legal definitions vary from planet to planet. The Salarians embrace the concept. Humans have diverse and contentious opinions. Do my implants make me a transhuman? That would be telling. What? I'm sorry. That was a joke. You are fully human. Cerberus extensively reconstructed <laughs> you, but your brain functions are organic. Don't ever do that again. <laughs> That's funny. A play on don't ask, don't tell, and chance. Okay, it's just too funny. I'm sorry. Here we go. We got Sir Cash, but we didn't find what I was looking for, so... Uh, some more planets have appeared. Oh, the Anos Basin! Oh, is that where I'm at? I'm in the Anos Basin? Right, okay, horse head nebula. We are going to circle back around. That's it for the Horsehead Nebula? Okay, this is one of those I have to wait for a Reaper invasion. Okay. So they'll break stuff and we'll open up more. Gemini Using large amounts of fuel. All right, let's, can I save? I cannot save. All right, we're just gonna wing it. I found something. Uh huh.
other side of the planet. Boom! Cruiser in Nairobi. Fly, you fool. Reapers eluded. Back to Han. Hey, Haberdasheries. Signal confirmed. There we go. Find here. Credits. Very good. We're only at fifty percent. Uh, what's in there? No, leave me alone. Aha! Nice. Faster than light jump nope. successful. Okay. Don't want to do that yet. Investigate service presence and extract Turian survivors. Okay, actually, I guess we are going to do that. But we're going to take a minute so I can pee and then drink some more water and we'll be right back. So we're back. Post X nineteen. Yep. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Evasion successful. No, sir. Eluded. Okay. Doesn't seem to be anything there yet. <laughs> 